manholes are put in place to serve as underground utility vaults for maintenance of underground public utility and services such as water, sewers, telephone, electricity and storm drains. But open manholes as a result of the activities of vandals poses danger to pedestrians as well as motorists in the FCT. 35-year-old Nancy Izek shares her experience with an open manhole. It was actually rained that morning, so it wasn't like it was flooded. But there were dead paper, nylon, dry leaves, wet leaves covering this particular place. I didn't even know there was manhole in it around that area. So I just stepped. I was walking, so I didn't notice there was manhole because it was covered with dirt. Unknown to me, I just stepped my right foot in front and the next thing I fell, I sank down inside. But thank God there were people who were there to rescue me and pulled me out. It was a very terrible experience. It was even difficult for me to get home because if not for the grace of God, I would have had maybe a terrible injury. In recent times, the Federal Capital Territory Development Authority has made efforts to solidify the covers of these manholes to ensure the safety of pedestrians. Meanwhile, security agencies have continued to condemn activities of vandals in the nation's capital. FCT Commandant of Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps, Patrick Upan, says there are various degrees of penalties for anyone found vandalizing government's critical infrastructure. So if we observe that there are suspicious elements locking around those infrastructure, we should do well to notify Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps or other security agencies for prompt action. Many are of the opinion that provision of barricades, caution tapes, and any other means of safety nests should be made available for open manholes. Asabi Williams, NTA News.